was a 16 week uh, project and I have to say it was amazing uh, from beginning to the end but this was a different beast and it was completely different and that in itself I learned so much well, uh, especially in regards to the 10 minute time span it was immense in uh, understanding and um, a different way and a different approach at uh, creating projects and I, I have to say that um, the initial piece ended up being something different at the end. Taught me how to tell a story in a short amount of time, but to also implement that into, into longer stories. Cut them and make them smaller segments all throughout a longer project. And I think that's going to be invaluable in the future and bring things together. But I've learned a lot of editing. Duck you, you! <laughs> it's you, it's me, it's us, it's all of us. It feels interesting because it's something that I haven't done, I haven't made a project for a long time, so it's kind of like, oh, am I done or do I have more work to do on it after the premiere? But I'm really excited to... Uh, be at this point and to be seeing everyone else's and seeing the outcome of the 16 weeks. The community is a really awesome one, um, like the people I met and the knowledge I gained about like the program was like that we're using and everything. Um, also storytelling, definitely, since we worked a lot on that. You should definitely apply um, if you're interested at all in like filmmaking even if it's not necessarily documentary filmmaking um though you would make a documentary it's something that you're going to learn about filmmaking in general um so i would say do it go for it there's a really wonderful resources and you get to be a member of spnm which is cool yay spnm <laughs> <laughs>
think most of all I learned and that I've been needing to learn my whole entire life is time management and yeah. overcoming things. The moment we showed our class um, our documentary is because for me what my documentary is about is something that I kept so dear to my heart and that I never told people. So I think that that moment solidified things for me and um, it, it was really a growing moment for me. One thing like that docu was so like, um, so big about is being honest and true. So I felt like coming in, I wasn't totally being honest with myself of what I wanted to do. And so like throughout and like hearing people talk, like it really helped me to do the piece that I did because I wasn't gonna do it at first. So like everybody around kind of, like what they were saying was like, I should do this. At the end of the day, like it kind of helped me and pushed me forward to doing what I really wanted to do and was to tell this story because if I feel like I didn't do this, I, I would be a different person. Like I still would be like shy and closed up. Like Docu like really helped me come out of my shell and really like, solidify my life like and where I wanted to go and the person that I could be because I think I wasn't being honest with myself before this experience. I say go for what you really want to do. If you have the story that stays in the back of your mind that's the story you should tell and um, start shooting as soon as possible because that's like number one. Even when they tell you not to like get a camera and sneak and do it because you will <laughs> fall behind so like that's one of the things that I would tell people um I just want to say thank you Nadia for helping me so much and believing in me and remembering me that I really wanted to be in this class thank you